Hello, hello. You know who it is. It is your girl, Health Coach Tamla, the Juice Magician, coming to you guys on day 30 of our 30 day fall into fitness wellness challenge. It is day 30. It is the absolutely last day of our 30 day challenge, October the 30th. We started this journey on October the 1st and it is 30 days in the books. Check, 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 check. It's over. So today it was our juice day, rest day. You see, I'm still sipping on my juice. I did about 90% juice today. I did have a small meal earlier, but I'm definitely committed to the juicer. So just to recap. So we started this journey on October the 1st. And I know when I started, I knew I wanted to do it because I knew I could do it because I did one back in April. But I still was a little bit nervous because I'm like, okay, once I put it out there, I have to commit to it. And once I commit to it, I have to see it through. Okay. So once I hit the ground running on day one, October 1st, I knew I had to go all the way through the process with no excuses. Tired, not tired, um, busy, not busy, early, late, middle of the day, whenever it was, I had to get it in and get it done. And I made it happen. And the results have been amazing. So just a couple of things. The main thing, I had a lot of people asking me, well, how much weight did you lose? Okay, that's a valid question. But it really wasn't about weight loss. So it's, it's not about weight loss. So I did lose about seven pounds, but it's not about weight loss. I didn't expect to come out 30 days later to be skinny mini after a 30-day challenge. That wasn't the point. The point is... What I gained, not what I lost. I lost seven pounds, but what did I gain? I gained strength. I gained stamina. Um, I showed perseverance. I showed willpower. I showed commitment. I took care of myself. So all those gains are bigger than that seven pounds of weight loss. So the weight loss is good, but I keep making a point that it's not about the weight loss. If you go into any program, if your mind is so set on, I need to lose weight, I need to lose weight, I need to lose weight, it's not it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen the way that you desire for it to happen. You're stressing yourself out thinking about it. Your mind is in the, in the wrong place. So you're pushing your body instead of loving on your body. You're punishing your body instead of loving on your body. You are going into the situation with a negative attitude, which already just sets you, you know, down in a deficit instead of going into it with a positive attitude as if, I do want to lose weight, but it's about feeling good and just being happy and enjoying the journey. And that's what it's about. So if you have your mind so dead set on, I want to lose weight, it, it makes it that much more difficult to release the weight because you, you're allowing yourself to be so wrapped up in, in just that small portion of what the journey is truly about. The journey is about just being committed, being consistent, being persistent, um, having the willpower, um, taking care of your body, treating yourself, um, being kind to your body, making time for yourself. That's what it's about. The strength that comes from it, the stamina that comes from it, the the energy that comes from it, the, the feeling of just being light and free that comes from it, the feeling of accomplishment that comes from it. And guess what? The weight loss will come as a result of all those other things. The weight will release as a result of all those other things that you gain from your experience. So it's not about the weight loss. I never push um, weight loss, even with my juices, with um, being vegan, vegetarian, whatever it is. I never push it as a weight loss method because that's not the, 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 um, the total goal. It is a goal. Because everybody wants to look good and, you know, look good in their clothes and, and, and shed a couple of pounds. But it's not the main thing. It's about all the other things that's going to come along with it. And then the weight is going to just naturally release without me having to force it. I don't have to force the weight to release because it's going to just naturally release because I'm feeling good. I'm not stressed out. I'm, I'm doing the things that are causing the weight to be released. And I'm treating my body well. If you treat your body well, it will treat you well. So that's very important. I have so many people calling me, asking me what juices can they drink to lose weight or does CMOS make me lose weight or the biggest thing is weight, 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 weight. And this is something specifically to women, I, I feel, because that's the biggest question. Well, what juices can I drink to lose weight? Well, does the CMOS gel make me lose weight? What can I do to lose weight? 
it's it's a total package. It's not just one thing. You you can't not just drink. You could do a three day cleanse, and yeah, you're gonna see some weight loss because you're doing you have drank juice for three days and you didn't really consume any food. So definitely, you're gonna see weight loss. But is that sustainable? Is that after that, then what? Then what are you doing to maintain that? What are you doing in your mind? The mindset is where the progress is going to come from. So I just want to encourage you that if you are on a weight loss journey, if you are tired of being on that weight loss roller coaster, that that um, up and down, um, trying this, trying that, allow me to coach you. I, I'm, I am a health coach. First and foremost, and so I'm I'm not a um, personal trainer, but I am a health coach, and my desire is to help you change your mindset because I did it for myself and I did it for the people in this household. So change your mindset around food, change your mindset around um, your weight, change your mindset of, around the things that causes us to even to hold on to the weight that we we truly want to release. So it starts in here, and once you get it set in your mind it'll start trickling down. So that's my desire. If you are looking to ditch that diet roller coaster once and for all, if you're looking to change your mindset around food, if you're looking to change your mindset around this up and down yo-yo fad diets, uh, keto this and, and, and this, this diet, this, this diet, that, if you're looking to change your mindset around these things, then I'm your girl. I not only have I done it for myself, but I'm able to duplicate that process and help others do the same thing. So I'm telling you, it's, it's, it's definitely an, an experience because I've always been a thick girl. So I've, I've, I've accepted that I've always been a thick girl, but I had to just make some adjustments and really come to grips with um, who I am, what I desire for my life, um, what I desire the outcome to be, what I desire to see. And then put those things into motion and just watch the effects just trickle down, trickle down. So that's what it's about. So if you're looking for a coach, if you're looking for an accountability partner, if you're looking for someone to stretch you, if you're looking for someone to, to help um, guide you through your journey um, to just, just feeling happier and healthier overall without being focused just on, well, how much weight am I going to lose? I'm your coach. I am health coach Tamala. I just completed a 30-day fall into fitness wellness challenge. It was challenging, but I completed it. Um, I hope that I have encouraged someone. I know that I've encouraged some people to, even if you did not follow through with my videos, I know I've encouraged people to work out a little bit more or to put a little bit more effort into themselves. I know I have. And I, just for that, I'm, I'm grateful. For whoever I have touched, whoever I have reached, and I hope that y'all have enjoyed my videos. I hope y'all have enjoyed the, the inspirational words that I try to leave with every video that I post. I try to leave inspiration throughout every video because that's what it's about. It's about the, the, the loving yourself and taking care of yourself and everything else will fall into place. So if you're looking to ditch that diet roller, that diet roller coaster, if you're looking to have a mindset change around food and, and healthy lifestyle and healthy living, if you're looking to just feel better, uh, feel more energized, look better, um, do better, I'm your coach. I'm health coach Tamala, the Juice Magician. It's just powered by Revitalize Me. And I can be found on on Instagram and Facebook at Revitalize Juice and More. If you're interested in coaching, if you're interested in, in just having a consultation and just thinking about the possibilities, if you're interested in investing in yourself in a real way, not surgery, not quick weight loss pills, not um, fad diets, but you're really interested in investing in yourself, in your health, in your fitness, in your wellness, I'm your coach. All right. You can hit me up on Instagram or Facebook at Revitalize Juice and More. My website is coming very, very soon. I'm going to have a lot of positive information on there. Um, and yeah, let's make it happen. Shoot me a message, leave a comment, like, share. And it's the next go round. It's your girl, Health Coach Tamla, the Juice Magician. Drink, eat, and be well, be kind, be a good human, 
and take care of yourself and each other. Peace.